I was appointed to the Commission for the Blind by Herschel Loveless, Governor Herschel Loveless. And Kenneth was here, we hired him. He said, there's no library here. How can you have a place for the blind without a library? And so that very day, he was a man of action. That very day, he got on the phone, called the Library of Congress and said, I'm the director of a rehab center in Iowa. We don't have a library and we need one. And within just a few weeks, the gym was filled with hundreds and hundreds of books for the library. I understand that <laughs> they didn't have any um, shelves to put the books on. No, we didn't. They were all, all over the floor, all over the floor. And only Florence Grandis knew where, where each book was. She did a fabulous job. But they were all over the floor. Many of them had been, had been shipped in from England, and they were dirty. They were dusty, and each, each book had to be washed off and dusted off. And they used the lockers. As oh, yeah, to put the books in. Any place that we could find to put books in. So anybody who wanted to use a gym didn't have a locker. <laughs> first things first. <laughs> and so that was the beginning of it, and everybody worked and got those books on the shelves, and, and it was a beautiful library.